Hello everyone. In this video, I'll be showing you four quick tips on how to significantly improve your audio quality using Audacity. It doesn't matter if your audio was recorded with Audacity or if it was recorded externally and imported. And for those of you who may not know, Audacity is a free software. With that said, let's get started. So the first thing that you're going to want to do is to open Audacity. This is what the interface looks like. Then you're going to either import or open an audio file. Once the file is opened, save your work so you don't lose any progress made if anything was supposed to happen in the middle of the editing. Now that the file is saved, the first thing that you're going to want to do is to normalize the recording. To do this, ensure that the audio is highlighted, then go to the Effects tab and click Normalize. You will see it process for a second. Now that the audio is normalized, I am going to let you listen to it and then listen once again when it's edited. Hello everyone. In this video, I'll be showing you four quick tips on how to significantly improve your audio quality using Audacity. Now that the audio is fully normalized, we are going to reduce the background noises. To do this, highlight a few seconds of the file, then go to the Effects tab and click Noise Reduction, and then click Get Noise Profile. Once you click Get Noise Profile, click this area right outside of the audio to highlight the entire audio track. Once this is done, go back to the effects tab, click noise reduction, and then click OK. It will once again process for a second. Next, we want to bring out the bass and the treble in the voices. So go back to the effects tab, click equalization, then click treble boost and click OK. This has to be done when the audio is highlighted. In order to get the bass boost, repeat the steps but instead of clicking treble boost, click bass boost and then click OK. The last thing that you'd want to do to your audio file is to set a limiter on the recording to reduce variations in volumes and also to reduce clippings. So I like the recording and go back to the effects then click limiter. Leave all the settings at default which is at minus 10 decibels and click OK. So now let's listen to the audio once more to see if it sounds any better than it did before. Hello everyone. In this video, I'll be showing you four quick tips on how to significantly improve your audio quality using Audacity. Okay, so it sounds a whole lot better, but I'll let you be the judge. You may not be able to get the full quality through this video, but I assure you that you will when you edit your file. So that's it for this video, guys. Thank you so much for watching, and I'd really appreciate it if you were kind enough to subscribe. Cheers, and I'll see you in the next one.